if you have not changed these new fortnite game your settings so guys you are losing a huge fps so guys in this video i'm gonna show you all the new changes in fortnite game your settings you need to apply in order to get the better fps and lower input delay and guys here is the performance before and after doing these tweaks in my game your settings so make sure to watch this complete video and let's go straight into it before starting this video here is a pre-made fortnite game your settings pack you can download straight from my website link in the description or you can download from my discord server also inside you will find out best game you settings and gear up boosters open up this first file and inside you will find out all the pc specs like high end pc low end pc and madden pc you can guys use these fortnite config file in order to boost fps according to your pc build if you go for the high end pc inside you will find out these three resolution if you go for madden you will find out these two resolution and if you go for madden pc here you will find out these resolution and you can guys simply apply it in your pc by simply drag and drop it inside your directory let me show you real quick how to do it so for example i want to apply my this resolution so you need to first of all drag this folder out of this pack now open up this folder and here you will find out your game use settings so now simply copy this file from here and now next you need to go for your fortnite search bar next you need to go for your windows search bar and search for percentage local app data percentage sign again and open up this directory inside you need to search for fortnite game folder so press f from your keyboard and find that fortnite game folder go inside it go for saved config windows client and here you will find out your game user settings simply right click here and go for paste button and you need to simply replace the file in the destination but i'm not replacing it because i will also show you how you can manually apply it because a lot of people don't want to download any file from internet so therefore i'm gonna show you how you can do it manually so guys you need to go for your game use settings and first of all make sure to uncheck this read only box from the properties of your fortnite now hit apply and click ok now simply double tap and open up your fortnite game use settings now inside you need to scroll all the way up and now let's start over this optimization so in the very first step you need to go for this b show grass and you need to simply turn off the settings by setting it onto the false and this will guys allow your pc by disabling the grass and it will allow you to getting more fps in fortnite with your bow and pc next here you will find a show fps i have already disabled it then stop rendering in the background also make sure to guys disable the settings this is the new settings introduced by the uh, epic game so therefore you need to disable it next here you will find a latency tweak this is actually the uh, latency mode inside your fortnite settings so i have already disabled it also now you just scroll down and you need to find out the next settings and that is the ray tracing you need to guys also make sure to turn off the ray tracing if you are playing on the DirectX 12 but if you are playing on the performance mode so guys it doesn't matter next here you will find that the front end frame rate limit you need to guys adjust it onto the 120 fps by default it is onto the 60 fps or sometime 80 fps so you need to set it onto the 120 fps next here is the most important settings that you need to also disable and that is the energy saving so guys you need to disable the settings on your pc in order to get the maximum performance out of your pc so guys simply set it onto the false by default it is onto the true next here you will find out energy saving enable focus loose also guys go for it and set the settings onto the false and disable the settings next you will find out energy saving level focus loose one guys it doesn't matter because you have disabled the main settings now you need to scroll down and find out the next settings inside this fortnite game your settings file so guys next here we go over this b allow low power mode and i have also disabled it on my pc now you need to go over the next settings and that is your resolution settings and this is important in order to get the best performance and guys you need to adjust here the resolution according to your pc specs you can ask me in the comment according to your pc i will suggest you which is the best resolution for your pc in fortnite for getting better fps so guys for me i'm playing on the native 1920 by 1080p but guys i can also play with the 1440 by 1080p with the stretch resolution and if you are low end pc you can guys try 800 by 640 1024 by 768 like this after that you need to scroll down and find out this next setting that is important and that is the scalability group now go for your resolution quality you can guys set it around from 85 percent to 100 percent or you can test it out by yourself next here you will find out this view distance quality guys set it onto the zero anti-linking quality set it onto the zero shadow quality set it onto the zero 
global illumination quality set it on to the zero reflection quality set it on to the zero post process quality set it on to the zero texture quality set it on to the zero effect quality also set it on to the zero foolish quality set it on to the zero shading quality set it onto the zero and at the end landscape quality also set it onto the zero by setting all the settings onto the zero it is guys allow you to getting more fps and setting your all settings onto the low therefore you can get the maximum performance now after doing it now you just scroll down and here is some other chat settings guys you can simply leave it now you need to go for this file option and click on the save button and save these changes inside your fortnite game use settings so guys once you have made these changes now you need to go for your fortnite game use settings go for properties and you can guys check mark onto the read only therefore you can use the same settings every time you launch the fortnite and guys if you have made any changes in fortnite so guys that will automatically revert in the next time you play the fortnite if you want to make the changes with the time so guys uncheck this box otherwise if you want to save the settings permanently on your pc so guys check mark on the read only box and simply hit apply and click ok so guys now let's enjoy some gameplay with these settings on my pc and guys i hope so you love it so please make sure to let me know your opinion about this video in the comment below and show your love by clicking on the like button so guys see you again in the next video